As they say, all good things must come to an end. Welcome to Heating Up here on SHOT. My name is Ryan Waters. For the final time, we talk heat basketball this season with two five-year guys, Ed Day and Meddy, Mike Zayans, in your final couple of games in the regular season. What goes through your mind? Your final game? You've been here five years and this is, the, this is it. Yeah, um, I, don't, I don't like to think a lot about like, what comes after the game. I like to stay focused and I like to keep my mind um, ready for the upcoming game. And then once the games are over, that's when I'll start thinking and like, thinking about, oh, what am I going to miss and like all these little things. But for now, I just like to keep my mind ready and prepared for the games. Mike, how about you? Are you, are you peeking ahead? Yeah, well, I'm just like Ed. Like, I think we just have to focus on the process and just stay focused in the game. And if we think too much about it, then we won't be able to perform as well. It might take away from that. But I, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited about this weekend. I, I've, basketball's always been a huge part of my life, and I've, I, I'm excited to have uh, p people come and watch me play my last university games. It's TRU from Kamloops here Thursday, and then you go there on Saturday. I know you don't want to talk about after the game, but what are you going to miss? What's the thing that you'll miss the most? Oh, I'll definitely miss the camaraderie, like being part of a, being part of a unit, being, um, being able to play um, organized basketball, because like I, I, I would, I, I'll be, I'll still be playing around, but it's not going to be the same. Mm -hmm. Like it's, you're not going to have the same jokes. Like you're not going to be hanging out with the same people, seeing the same faces every day. I'll definitely miss a lot of that. Mike, your most memorable moment as a member of the Heat. Uh, my most memorable moment was actually the first day <laughs> I met Eddie Medi at, at UBCO. I was at the the ID camp, and I, I didn't really know anyone. And Eddie and me actually met at the rim. And uh, Eddie tried to block me, but I think I got the best of him. And, and uh, yeah. He dunked on you? Yeah, but Mike, it's, you, can't, you can't just uh, I've blocked you so many other times, so, you know, it's fine. Okay. I'll, I'll let you have that one. TRU, you got him here. What do you know about the Wolfpack? <clears throat> well, we've, like, I, I, I really enjoy playing against them. And, like, the last two years, like, we've had really good battles. Mm -hmm. And... Um, Last year we beat them both games, and this year they have a few new players. But um, overall, it's still the same gameplay, I, I believe. And so we're like we're trying to adapt to the gameplay and um, make little changes. But eventually, we're still going to be playing our own game, I believe. Well, guys, good luck this weekend. I'll lace them up for the final time. UBC Okanagan will host TRU Thursday and then head to Kamloops on Saturday for their final game of the regular season. For more information on the basketball teams, volleyball teams, and all the other athletics going on at UBCO, check out goheat.ca. For Heating Up here on Shaw, I'm Ryan Waters.